good one, I hope. Ha <laughs> ha oh, The bar looks great! <laughs> I mean, even better than I'd imagined. Man, thanks for giving me a place to crash, huh? Why, uh... Why'd you break me out of Rollins, anyway? I mean, you don't know me. I... I could be a bloodthirsty maniac. An axe-wielding ex-con. A door-to-door -door salesman. Ah, poetic. Charming. You know, one of the first people I ever robbed was a wandering poet. Yeah, she came to our camp when I was a kid. She recited some poems from the old days, some commercial jingles, she called them. I thought they were nice. And when she fell asleep, I went through her satchel and stole all her mentats from my brother. And, uh, that was that. Ah, look, uh, I'm gonna make this short and sweet. Now, these blood eagles are bad news, and they need to go down hard. Now, you already stuck it to them once at the labor camp, so... I know you've got what it takes. You feel like helping me wipe out the rest of these chumps? For everyone in Appalachia. I mean, they're out of control. But they take what they want and kill anyone that gets in their way. When their numbers start to drop, they kidnap innocent settlers, force them to join the gang by shoving chems down their throat. Things I've seen them do would make you sick. That's why I bailed out. It was too much. Even for me. Ha <laughs> ha! Now that's what I'm talking about. If we want to take the Blood Eagles down, killing the sheep isn't going to do the trick. We need to go after the Shepherds. But before we head down that road, We'll need help, which means I need to right a few wrongs. Oh, I don't know. Take your pick. I've stolen, I've looted. Pretty much pulled every dirty trick in the book. Well, since I'm not exactly responder material, that doesn't leave me many options now, does it? Let's just say I tend to keep mixed company. Don't worry, though. I'm pretty sure my friends will help us out. Well, I, uh, I think so. Anyway. Oh, of course not. But taking down the top dogs would reduce them to a bunch of unorganized stragglers. That's why we concentrate on targeting their leadership. Ah, good. And I know exactly where we should start. Best bet would be my old pal Edwin, who, uh, piss him off, I stole his stupid diary. So, uh, if we want his help, we need to get it back for him. Can you handle that? Well, you see, I'm a people person. And I like to listen to people gab, especially the tipsy ones. I mean, there's more to it, but uh, let's just leave it there for now. Well, he's the leader of a different gang of raiders. Really tough guy. Sharpened his teeth to points. You know, classy. See, his diary has a lot of... Uh, Precious, sad little secrets. Uh, stuff you wouldn't want your gang to hear, if you catch my meaning. Well, to impress the Eagles, I sort of stole the diary and stashed it away. So, he's not exactly thrilled with me right now. Always. What do you need? I tell you what, I'll buy this round, and the rest will be out of your pocket. This stuff doesn't come cheap, you know. 
know if I'm in your way.
So, did you find it? Right, so, my plan. Get ready, brace yourself. I've got a buddy named Sage, who joined a stupid cult and got himself swept up into their nonsense. I, uh, need you to find them. Get them out of there. And in the meantime, I'll try and get this, uh, diary back to Edwin. Maybe that'll convince him to back us up, hmm? Sound good? Well, for a while, he was into a Tato cult. They just spoke to and then ate Tato's. Um, <laughs> I try not to judge, you know, so... Moving on, uh... Then he was in a cult that believed we were all living in some kind of terminal program or robotic AI unit. Uh, I don't remember anymore. Uh, then he did some uh, Mothman thing. Uh, might still be his jam. Uh, or maybe he's into some other cryptid now. Uh, it, uh, it doesn't matter, honestly. Sage. He's a... Uh, a violent murderer, a sloppy thief, and used chems until his brain rotted down to almost nothing. Now he sees the world differently than we do. The last time I saw him, I was trying to get out of the Blood Eagles, and he was joining a new cult. Uh, kinda? I mean, look, I haven't met a cult that I thought was good for him yet. Hmm? He stays with them for a month or so, and then I have to bail him out. All I know is the more he experiments, the more it's messing with his mind. But trust me, <laughs> you'll see. Seriously? Weird. I didn't even pay you anything. You're kind of creeping me out, honestly. Before you go, care for a drink or anything? All I have left is a brother. Name's Frankie. But that's, uh, that's something we can talk about some other time. <laughs> I might still be. I gotta check my membership cards. But seriously? Yeah. It was fun. Rough, but fun. Picked up the wrong sort of attention and got pulled in the wrong direction. Bam! Instant Blood Eagle. Worst Blamco product ever. Well, if you see me again, then everything went swimmingly. Good one.
Oh, I'm late for the party. Very, very late. Holy mod man, shepherd. Good one, I hope. Ah, uh, he ran off, right? Yeah, he does that. But don't worry, he'll find us when he wants to. But in the meantime, words come back from Edwin. Turns out recovering his sad little diary isn't gonna be enough, so I thought of another idea. Find the stolen key to his weapons cache. Now that, and killing the traitor that took it, might be enough to flip him in our direction. Some nobody who thinks they have it all figured out. I don't even know their name. Hell, I don't even want to know. I just want that key. Uh, someone from Edwin's gang decided they wanted out. Now, honestly, Edwin can get uh, pretty weird, so I can't say I blame them. Anyway, this idiot thought stealing the key and then blaming it on a rival gang would cause all sorts of problems for Edwin. And, uh, they were right. You do-gooders are something else. You know that, right? I'll be stuck here waiting for Edwin to make peace, so thanks for stepping up. Again. Uh, he wasn't interested in meeting with me just yet. Uh, he can't trust me. So, he sent someone from his gang. Ronnie. She accepted the journal on his behalf and said he'd meet me here at your place soon. When he feels like it. She said I should wait for him. Now, the weapons cache isn't really the point. This traitor is clearly trying to goad Edwin's gang and a rival gang into a confrontation. Big mistake. Sounds good. And if you happen to find the traitor who stole the key, offing them might uh, be a good idea. Let me know if I'm in your way.